Hello everyone. Today we have discussed about Baird Savart's law. This is the figure of current element ideal. We fix one point P from the current element ideal. R is the distance between the P point and current element. Theta is the angle between the current element ideal and the point of interest P. Bayer's Savart law states that the differential magnetic field intensity dh produced at a point P by the differential current element ideal is proportional to the product ideal and the sine of the angle theta between the element and the line joining P to the element and is inversely proportional to square of the distance or between P and the element. This is the expression for Baird Savart law. D height is directly proportional to ideal sin theta divided by R square. By equate this equation adding proportionality constant K. So D height is equal to K I dl sin theta divided by r square. Here the k value is equal to 1 divided by 4 pi. By replacing this k value by 1 pi 4 pi. So the equation becomes dh is equal to i dl sin theta divided by 4 pi r square. So this is the magnitude value for magnetic field intensity by using by Savart's law. It has written in Vector form. D height is equal to I DL divided by 4 pi R square AR vector. Here AR vector is the unit vector pointing from the differential element of current to the point of interest. We know one relation B is equal to mu h. B is the magnetic flux density. Mu is the permeability of the medium. H is the magnetic field intensity. Mu is equal to mu naught mu r. Mu naught is the permeability of free space. Mu r is the relative permeability. In air medium, mu r is equal to 1. So this is the basic relation for magnetic flux density and magnetic field intensity. By using this relation, we have written the differential magnetic flux density dB is equal to mu I dL sin theta divided by 4 pi r square. It is also written in vector form dB is equal to mu I dL divided by 4 pi R square A R vector. This is the mag 
discrete value for differential magnetic flux density. This is the vector representation for magnetic flux density. We can have different current distributions, lines current, surface current and volume current. We define I as the line current density in amperes per meter and K as the surface current density in amperes per meter square and J as the volume current density in amperes per meter cube. So, the source elements are related as I D L is equal to K D S is equal to J D V. I is the differential current element, K is the surface current element, J is the volume current element. DL, DS and DV are the differential line element, differential surface element and differential volume element. The bias savat law can be expressed in terms of distributed current sources or height is equal to line integral of I D L J or vector divided by 4 pi R square. Then the magnetic field intensity is equal to the surface integral of K D S divided by 4 pi R square A R vector. Similarly, we have written magnetic field intensity in terms of volume integral of J D V divided by 4 pi R square A R vector. Thank you. இந்த வீடியோ படிச்சிருந்தா லைக் பண்ணுங்க ஷேர் பண்ணுங்க சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணுங்க இந்த வீடியோ படிச்சிருந்தா லைக் பண்ணுங்க ஷேர் பண்ணுங்க சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணுங்க இந்த